Okay, so good morning. Um, it's Rachel in Central Texas from Zone 8B. I always get that wrong. Um, it's a super windy day right now uh, for Texas. I mean, I guess not really, but because it's Texas. Whatever happens here, happens. Um, I'm gonna be planting some plants. Um, I'll probably, since it's so windy, just do a really speed up video of um, all the plants I'm gonna be planting today. Um, and uh, coming soon will be, uh, I'm gonna be building a metal planter maybe Friday or early next week, if I have time. <laughs> and uh, hopefully we get some rain here soon. Um, yeah, and I'll go over really quick the plants I'm gonna be planting, so. Okay, so I have some <clears throat> red salvia I'm gonna be planting. I have a uh, woodland bottle brush, I think is what it's called. Woodlander's Hardy bottle brush. Um, I have some red lantana, and this is a Cape Honeysuckle. Um, I'm gonna be planting somewhere over here. I tried it once before, and uh, it got killed by the big frost. I'm gonna try it again, we'll see. I might, I know it's not native, but um, about half of these are native and half of them aren't. I have some, this is the Oh So Easy Hot Paprika Rose I'm gonna try out here. And I have some red yarrow over here and then a dwarf um, pomegranate and a red uh, hot poker plant over there. So I'm gonna get all these in the ground. Um, there's also a few goldenrod over here and um, firepower nandina just because I want a couple evergreen pieces um, that'll just uh, kind of be staples and uh, structure in winter time. Um, but I'm gonna get those in the ground here and hopefully it'll go by quickly. <laughs> To like a container almost kind of thing and I want to water it in I'm gonna plant it a little bit below um, or not a little bit below 
Well, I'm going to plant it right at the lip of this kind of pot. This is open bottom, um, just a cinder block. And uh, I'm going to put the soil level a little lower so that when I water it in, it, it can kind of hold a little more water instead of just spilling out over the top.
the tags on these. This is the goldenrod. It is fireworks. I'm going to forget what this is, so tag it. So I was just recording nothing because I thought I pressed play and then I realized it was still on picture mode. So mm, fun stuff there. Um, I'm going to turn the camera around and show you what I just planted. Um, it's super windy, uh, so I'm probably not going to finish planting everything today. Uh, I did get quite a bit in the ground. Um, since the camera blew over, I don't want to risk that happening again, so I'm not gonna videotape the rest, but I'll show you here what I planted. So this is the red yarrow. I planted one here and one there. Um, I planted red salvias. There's um, more red salvia here. This is another salvia. Um, it's that um, two-toned one. And then here is um, a lantana that I previously planted. Everything, I tag everything because it's so tiny um, right now because it's all babies um, that I can't find it when I come back into mow and weed eat and um, I want to be able to uh, like I said uh, put up a garden uh, mulch up this whole area make them uh, obvious um, apart from the grass <laughs> this is a so tall I love these I'm so excited about that um, this is an, uh, the red lantana I planted to, uh, just now and then this is a bicolored um, butterfly bush it's like purple and orange and pink, hot pink or red or something. It's really beautiful from the photos, so I'm pretty excited about this. This is a smoke bush I think I killed. I'm not sure. It might still be alive. We'll find out. Um, there's this guy that I planted, and um, I'll probably get um, this uh, bottle brush in the ground, but I won't videotape that, and then I'll probably get the red hot poker. And that's probably about it. But anyhow, thanks for joining this time and we will see you next time.